Hey there, fella. Hey. Me and Deke here knows hunting like nobody knows hunting. Well, that's partially true. I do know hunting like nobody does. Because Tom here is just a chatterbox. If anyone can tell me what that's from, you're the big male of the day. Plus a thousand G points. Yeah. G strings. What? What? Where my chat go? Come back. Where has my live chat gone? <laughs> What's going on? We got a lot of people already. All the above, Grim, Space Llama. Llama Monium, we got a whole bunch of llamas here. Dawson, Greek Lynx, Luke Sims, Makutcha, Gamer Ghost. What's going on, everybody? What's up, Wyatt? Yeah, if anybody can tell me what what that's from, I will be amazed, because most people don't even know that game exists. We got a couple of big males on our hands. I guess it's better than having big males in your hands. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Big boys. What's up, Anthony? Nazar? Yak Attack? Jaden? We got the whole, like, like, farm animal squad. We got yaks, llamas. Zaggy's not here, though. If he was, we'd have a cow. <laughs> Smoked him. <laughs> oh, we spooked some coyotes. Good. Barney. First to say your name right. He surprisingly said my name right, too. Look. Here's the thing. I I have a way with with pronunciations and spelling. I'm a nine time spelling bee champion. I I mean it's kinda unrelated, but it still has to do with language. I was the greatest, greatest Spanish student in the history of my high school. Just throwing that out there. No two. These are not uh, these are not claims that that are unverified. I remember when I took there was a Spanish placement test to find out just how good at Spanish we really are. I tested into junior year college Spanish when I was a junior in high school. That's some that's some big male Spanish. I don't get it. <laughs> DD holds big males all day. How have I been? I've been doing all right. I'm doing better. I had kind of a rough weekend, but things are looking up. I'm feeling good. Feeling like a big male. I exist. Yes, you do exist. You're here right now. You're back on the grind. Oh, I darn sure am. Would you hear that in the old the old title? <laughs> cough, cough, flinter. I don't want to get that checked out. Yeah, doesn't sound healthy. I missed the start because I was doing dinner. Well, that's why you're. That's why you're not an OG. We got we got all these OGs that come out early, bright and early. They're, they're here every week, and then there's you. <laughs> what is a true patch? Is it not out yet? It was out at like, f dude, I recorded a video at 5 a.m., and it came out at 5 a.m. I did it just before the update happened. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I couldn't sleep. Yeah, I know there's kind of like a big uh, thing going on with Call of the Wild, but I just can't, I can't be asked to play that game right now. I just, 
not feeling it. There's a male, a big male. Out of all the streams, G Man can actually spell and read color. C oh no, I nope. fucked it. Nope, it fucked almost it. had it. Broad shame upon myself. Soiled it! <laughs> <laughs> I can't spell. Teach me how to spell. Just put one letter in front of the other. I'm an oofing oofer. I opened the stream five minutes before start, but you weren't here. There's a difference between just like being connected and being here. I would know because 90% of the time when I'm in Discord, I'm not there, <laughs> even though I am connected. Usually attending to other matters. <laughs> Boob patch, I wish my ex had true boobs. True G. Couldn't pass up a stream with Flinter and G Man, no OG, just me. You are an OG though, you've been here, been here long time. Long, long time. Did you have max weight on that coyote track there? No. Up to 25, I assume? Yeah. Okay. Multiple big males in the drive. Toy! <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember me from like a couple months ago? Yeah, I think you were even on uh, when I did my 200 sub thing i can't remember if you if i read your name on that or not i think i did that would have been seven months ago sorry i let you down i do better next week it's gonna take a, a long time to earn my trust again is thicker than the average bear. About to kill 59 coyote. That would just about figure, because that's like the one thing on this map that I don't want. Mule deer. Might Golden as well get tower. up here. Alright. We can hold Man. hands and... What? I was going to say, Dawson asked, if anyone watched the Bristol Night Race, I did. I so I don't have cable, but I got I have the NASCAR app, so I was able to watch some of the onboard stuff. Kind of jump around and, and see what was going on. That's I was real sad. Man. Is he all alone? I think so. <laughs> I was really sad for Matt De Benedetto. He should have won. It's a pretty crazy race, though. There's a lot of, a lot of guys that could have won the race that had trouble. I thought today was CS Go. Man, I, I'm, I'm on the verge of <laughs> retiring from CS Go again. That was, that was big rough. I don't know if I have the, the fortitude to be able to. To grind that enough to be good again I can I can pull it together to make some good shots every now and then but the other like 20 times where I just died as soon as I even I'd see somebody and I just get smoked I ended up getting my rank back but man I'm, I'm silver four and honestly I feel like that's a stretch I should be like silver two <laughs> it's bad When is CS go? You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to like uh, hold me against my will just to make me play it. 
I wouldn't be opposed to playing it, but man, <laughs> I'd have to find another way to make it fun. Because I did not have fun trying to play it as it's intended. So like Call of the Wild. Yeah. Hmm. Is there a bridge we can eat off of? Yes. Okay. Call of the Wild needs gators and an Amazon map with a fish that eat your penis. They need to have... Have you heard of the fish that, like, swam inside of a dude's dick? Yeah. They need those. And then there'll, there'll be, like, a quick time event where you gotta, like, squeeze it back out. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. I can't imagine how bad that would feel. I don't want to. I'm just cringing thinking about it. I think you Silver... can crank it back out. What? Silver 4 isn't bad, but I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't deserve that rank. And that's not a good rank. I missed so many shots. Even when I was like trying to use like actual automatic weapons, I was still missing. Julia, have a good hunt, lads. Thank you so much for the, the Australian 7.99. You should be going to sleep soon. It'll be like what, 1:30 or something? Sounds right. True rack peen eater fish. We need it. it. Sounds like a great addition. I'm sure everyone's gonna forget about turkeys and pronghorn and doll sheep once they get a look at these fish. Yeah, I think I'm that's, not... that's what the community wants. Yeah, exactly. Someone tell TK. Okay. Leaving a lurk, AFK? Alright, thanks for the the watch time. <laughs> Popped in to say hi to everybody on my holiday. What's up, Matthew? Thanks for stopping by. Hope you enjoy your your time off from whatever. <laughs> Life. I'm just gonna sh I'm gonna shoot this thing because it's taken three years for it to get here. Okay. You hit exactly where it was. Yes. <laughs> It was indeed standing there at some point. <laughs> we have to ban Caleb because I mentioned turkeys? Send it. Oh, I'm out of arrows. No. Prepared as usual. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even... You see him? Yeah, he's in this, like... Behind the bush now, 50 meters out. Smoked him. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> that was the slowest reaction I've ever seen. <laughs> My crossbow just like reloaded itself. Mine too. <laughs> the community wants fishing, so add fish that go up to your junk. Perfect. Good to see you as a professional streamer. Only the best for my viewers. That's all. That's all that matters. Sleep tight, my little angel. <laughs> Wait, where did you just shoot him? The brain. Okay. It looks like you shot him in the brain, but from where I'm at? But obviously it's client side. He was looking at you. I know what yeah, happened. Yeah, he just... Well, he after he died, he turned his head towards you. Right, but for me, he was looking at me, so you couldn't have shot him, like, directly. Uh, I didn't think of that. Sense make. Yes.
You boys sound drunk? I actually thought about drinking, but then I realized at the time it was like 1130. <laughs> it's <laughs> probably not a good idea to start that soon. I've got housework I gotta do. They're dead inside, not drunk. That's pretty accurate. I'm dead on the outside right now, too. Oh, holy. Going back to bed after this stream, I think. <laughs> <laughs> oh, two hours of sleep will do that to you. Dude, <laughs> when I got up to record a five, I'm like, this is not good. <laughs> <laughs> As soon as you told me last night, yeah, I'm going to try to record and all this, and then you said, no, nah, I'll just try to do it in the morning, I knew that it was not going to go well. Well, I was supposed to sleep some before I recorded. That part didn't happen. Yeah. You smoked a joint. Well, here's the thing. I, I get this fairly often that people think I'm high. I've never smoked anything in my life. Cigarettes joint anything big males absolute monster male you don't smoke big males ooh 20 to 30 1.8 to 2.9 tell me what you got on that bad boy over there let me get a look see here that doesn't look eh, maybe it's decent nope it definitely ain't 18 to 24 alright good thing <laughs> my spotting level is like too so <laughs> Plantro was up all night then just about you could call it that but it was kind of a good thing that I couldn't sleep because I had forgotten to uh like take screenshots of all the stuff in the codex and back up my save in case things went horribly wrong so I remembered to do that when I got up that's good yes is that just a shadow or a rock I thought it might have been a monistic female pheasant but I think it's a rock where like you see the big rock over there yeah and then to the right of that there's a small darker shape but I think it's that small rock. There's only one way to find out. Yes. You don't smoke fish? No. I've smoked uh, chicken and turkey and ribs. Last time I spoke turkey, man, that was some really, really good shit. Mm. It's not just a boulder. It's a melanistic pheasant. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a stupid boulder. I can't believe the amount of time I've spent on loggers and then, like, actually hunting for rare pheasants on Hearst that I've never seen any at all. Wow. Must be bad. McLemmy probably killed like three, right? I would imagine so. I've told you about the, <laughs> the one he killed, right? Yeah. Spent six hours online by myself. He finally gets <laughs> on and kills one within like 30 minutes. Ah, uh, Jesus. It was only 4.8 gigs? That's actually more than I expected. Although, it was probably inflated a little bit because of the, uh, the true row. They're not with this, though. Oh, really? Yeah. They decided to tweak them a little bit. Yeah, they're going to give him another look, I guess. Holy.
Saggy, you lost all those 1,000 scoring animals. Absolutely smoked. Did I load all of my guns? Yeah. Yeah, a rare pheasant or a turkey would be pretty hot. That's about as difficult as anything you're going to find, though. Yeah. That's the truth. Oh, Matt Collins, what's up? There's a doe. A giant doe. Over on that hill, about 100 yards from here. Coyotes. Can't really see him, but freaking in that tall grass. Oh. People saying the game is is huge broke still? Uh oh. Are you kidding me? What kind of stuff's broke? I saw something on Zaggy's Facebook group. I think there were people that had all their lodges, like, undiscovered again, but that's not that big a deal. Wait, undis- Oh, like, I thought you were talking about, like, trophy lodges. Oh. Yeah. What the hell you mean? I would honestly, like, uninstall if I lost my trophy lodge. <laughs> That's why I back, that's specifically what I back my save file up for. I yeah. don't think I could keep playing the amount of hours and grind I put into getting that stuff. I almost believe for a second that, that might have been an albino pheasant over there. This pheasant right here. It's just the, the back end of that doe. Right in the head. I saw the doe and thought it was a pie bolt at first, to be honest with you. It's over here. Well, well how do you go over there? Because they made that animation for when you hit them, but for some reason they do it off the ground, too. <laughs> no big male. I saw he was 2.6 kilos, so I believe for a second he might have been decent, but... Oh, your maps are the same as before? Hmm. The geese aren't broke? I wouldn't mind doing that, because I don't have any geese in my life. Zaggy killed a diamond goose the other day, apparently. I can't make a lodge even though I had the DLC. Never had a lodge since the DLC was out. The hell? Still got an error when starting the game because it corrupted save games and my codex is still broken? Holy shit. Quality. Big problems. I think Dilly Can's on to it. They're actually trying to revive Classic by screwing up Call of the Wild so people have nowhere to turn to. It's a, a bold decision. We'll see if it works out. <laughs> well, if you just keep streaming with your influence. Yes. I'm bringing everyone to Classic. Hop on. 20 to 30. I need you to spot that. <laughs> the one on the left there? I don't know. I only see one. He's he looks... right in front of the rocks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 24 to 30. Oh, my. Lower weight, though, so I think he's probably like 27. I mean, that's fine. I haven't killed one that big in a while. Smoked him. Smoked him. Is there another male? God, I only saw that one. Yeah, there's one over here. I don't think it flew away. I'll see if I can find it. 
<laughs> you right, Aaron. Yep. Yeah. Let's take Bikini Bottom and push it somewhere else. Let's take our entire player base <laughs> and push it. Oh, there he is. He's small now. Was it that one? Oh, no, wait. Smoking. Same. I guess we got two. Timed that really well, though. Yeah. <laughs> this one won't be much bigger. Splat! That was my brother's nickname, like, legit for a while. Yeah. Not bad. That's pretty much the extent of the big male pheasants I've killed, so... Won't complain. I don't think... I've maybe killed 128 ever. It's... The thing is, you don't look at them half the time. They're probably not as rare as they seem. Yep. Yeah. Ton of people getting corrupt save files. Yeah, that's why I said it. You knew they were doing stuff with it. You gotta back that up when that sort of thing has happened before. I'll do that. I haven't updated yet, so. Yeah, you should definitely back up your game before you, uh. Oh, that's a big mail. 65 to 85 muley track. Holy. <laughs> 55 to 90 on one I just got. Classic is better. I tend to agree. I can definitely play classic a lot longer. Oh, wow. I just, I get burnt out on it so easily. If I have something to do, I can play Call of the Wild endlessly. But when I don't, Classic's easier to just... Like, I don't have anything to do in both games, but Classic I can play for longer. Yeah. How have we gotten so lucky to just see does running through the fields like this? I don't know. It's really nice. It paints a nice picture. It does. I haven't backed up the save yet. Better do it. Don't want to lose any any big males. If I lost mine, I would quit. There's no way I'd even have the the urge to, to try to get them back. Yep. That was from a time when I actually really enjoyed grinding the game, and I'm not at that point right now. Like my 1,000 red boy, even if I just lost that, I think that'd be enough. I'd be like, all right, that's, I'm good. <laughs> I'm, I'm out. Coming back. Yeah. Yeah, I just feel like they've, like, the last couple of updates, they've been bad enough that it's difficult to just be like, yeah, I want to go play. It's too yep. much stuff that's been wrong. Wow, Aaron. What? Aaron's level 10 on PC. He'd be so disappointed if he lost all of it. <laughs> ah, that's annoying. I, it. I saw what? like a, a stump that I thought was non-typical mule deer for a second because there was a different muley trotting by. There is a buck out there. Like a 150. By himself? Uh, I think so. He's just like behind that hill. Holy level 19. Holy. Classic graphics give me aid, so I like Call of the Wild better. If only Call of the Wild has more animals like Classic, it would be way better. Graphics aren't even that bad, honestly. I mean, hell, I've been playing, like, Deer Hunter 2005 and shit lately, so. 
these are these are still pretty good. Big game hunter three. I'll, I'll go ahead and, and give the answer for what I started the stream off with because nobody got it. That was that was from the OG Big Game Hunter, nineteen ninety eight. Tom and Deke just hanging out on the couch, roasting each other. Talking about all that newfangled hullabaloo. Oh, you lost your diamond piebald row. Disappeared from the log a while ago. It was, yeah, they, they reset it. And then, uh... Even before that, stuff was just disappearing. Like, I ended up having, um... One of my 1000s disappeared. I can't remember which one. Might have been Moose. Well, I had a lot of good stuff just disappear randomly. It sucks. Yeah. When I went to screenshot everything yesterday, like, I have 300 diamonds. Ish. Not quite. Uh, I think there's around a hundred that show. Where the rest went, I have no idea. Yeah. Classic graphics are definitely not better. Uh, for sure. I mean, <laughs> it's not even really debatable, but they're, they're good enough. They don't turn me off when I play the game by any means. I can play Big Game Hunter 3 and <laughs> have fun with that, then I can still have fun with this too. There he is. It's working. Holy. Right there. Just see his antlers, really. I think I see him. I just can't look at him with. No, oh, yeah, there he is. There he. <laughs> I think the whole update is a hoax. Only four point eight gigs. They only removed the can check. I think. Conspiracy. Yes. That was a good voice crack. Thank you. <laughs> I try. Where the one nineties whitetail at? Uh right. probably not within <laughs> not within 12,000 meters of me at any given point. So that means. Hmm. Where's Red Feather? What the hell? Oh. Yep, that's it. Red Feather is well, actually 12,000 away. There you have it, folks. I thought about doing Red Feather, but we did it the last couple weeks, so. Yeah. We've Try also something done new. it not on stream, and that's gone really well. Yeah, I hunted Red Feather twice, I think. <laughs> Didn't see a big rack whitetail or a bull elk. Voice is cracked. Stop making fun of me. I can put up with graphics for most games. Yeah. It would really have to look like a complete turd for me to just be like, eh, I'm into it. Wait. Karina still has her 1300 scoring diamond in the codex? I thought that was the whole point. Man. <laughs> She was saying, too, like, none of her stuff actually, like, did anything. You done Red Feather for the last month? And before that, it was nothing but Whiteheart, and then that went to 
garbage and it still sucks. So here I am. On one of my least favorite maps. <laughs> Okay, bye. What? The buck just turned and ran. Alright, well. I saw my bug caribou too. What? Well, that's good. <laughs> yeah, that's real encouraging. Consider those bugs zapped. Well, now I'm not going to touch multiplayer for a few more days to make sure they actually did the reset properly. <laughs> that sucks. Newer game with high graphics to so a 1080 Ti is gonna drop frames in some areas. Mm, I don't know. For Call of the Wild? Yeah. I never get frame drops even when I'm recording. Yeah. That's what I have. 1080 Ti. I have a 1060 and it really doesn't drop much. Do you run like medium high? High. Yeah, it's pretty good. Just sit right at about 50 FPS. How you boys? My birthday was yesterday. Hey, happy birthday. Hope you had a good day. Feliz Navidad. Oh, yeah, you got that track? Feliz blah blah blah. Boop, 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 boop. What's this one give you? What track? This, this poopy right here. I just got a 100 to 130 back there. 85 to 120 on that. This is a group then. I got 110 to 135 on this. Oh! Holy, 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 holy. Yeah, 110 okay. to 125. That's that one we just spotted though. I think. Thanks for reminding me. Yeah. They made people's games corrupt. That's all they did. <laughs> Fuck. True patch. Man, if they could have a hot fix for a patch, oh, yeah, <laughs> it's not good. It sucks. They had so much momentum, man. They, they did. Just... It kills me. Uh, all the stuff they were doing with uh, Yukon and they had that free weekend or whatever. A big sale. Mm -hmm. Dude, uh, the game we had... Are. When Yukon was on that beta... The game had so much attention. Like, we had 1,200 viewers on a stream. Yeah. And then... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> True corrupts. <laughs> but there wasn't a big game hunter in 2009. That's where you're wrong, Aaron. It was actually... Uh what was Legendary Adventures on console it was Big Game Hunter 2009 on PC. So get smoked, kid. I'm just an encyclopedia of Big Game Hunter knowledge. Ready this is drop. accurate. Ready to drop the biggest facts on anybody in here. False patch. <laughs> they don't want Flinter to hit 100k. Fuck. 
Feels bad, man. Yep. Are you tracking those mule deer? Yeah. Okay. I didn't even know why we were going this way, and then I just hit that track again and realized. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I can't watch the stream. I'm in Virginia visiting old president's homes, but you're watching right now. That's more than I could ever ask. <laughs> Where the hell? I need. Where'd it go? I lost it too. Big game mail. Dude, DD needs to license a game with Cabela's Big Mail Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Big Mail Hunter. You're just out there shooting everything with 12 shots just to get it to drop. Well, your dad is. Yeah, that too. <laughs> well, you, so you play as yourself when you're hunting deer, and then when you go to hunt caribou or elk or anything, you're playing as your dad. Oh, okay. So you got some storyline <laughs> happening here. Yeah, it's just like, uh, what was that one? Dangerous Hunts 2013? I think it was 13. I think uh, 11 and 13 had a, a storyline like that. Did you find the track? Yeah. Thanks for telling me. I think, uh, <laughs> I think, what was the one that had the fire hyena? That was 13, right? Uh. Yeah, I think. That was, man. <laughs> it's a freaking, like... <laughs> 85 pound animal and you're just pumping it full of buckshot crossbow <laughs> arrows whatever you got it's just shaking it off yeah which cabela's game was the most realistic that one that is a very very good question Some of the old um, games were decent. It's just the graphics that kind of hurt them if, if we're talking about it realistically now. I imagine he just means realistic gameplay. That's what I think. Did you have this track? Yeah. Okay. I'm still on it. Oh, thought you were looking around. <laughs> the way you were walking, I thought you didn't have it. Oh, I got it. Holy. He can run, but he can't hide. 2011 was the hyena? Was 13 then oh, the one okay. where the wolves eat your brother? Because I thought that was the same game. It is the same game. What the heck was in 13? I don't remember any of it. Was 13 the one where I think it's a rhino is trying to yeet you in the middle of a fire? Probably... That, that seems familiar. I don't remember what the actual point of that game is, though. Like, what you're trying to do. Which? 2013. If that is a different... I thought the one with your brother getting smoked and then your dad getting smoked in that cave. I thought that was 2013. No, that, it does sound like 11... Now that he says that, I don't know. But anyway, get back on <laughs> which Cabela's game was most realistic. I'd, I'd say uh, maybe the deer hunt games. Like 2004, 2005. Big Game Hunter, 05 slash 06, maybe. I'd, I'd say the deer hunt games, because they didn't have any over-the-top like animal attacks and stuff in them. And you can get attacked by coyotes in <laughs> Big Game Hunter 05 and 06. Realism. Yeah. They were they were never like ultra realistic. But I mean where they really shined was just the the depth of them. The way you progressed through it was always really good.
your dad get smoked in 2013 and your brother's professional hunter douche? Why do I not remember that? Is it still the one where he gets eaten by wolves then, or no? Oh, wait, in 2013, never mind. Yeah, 2011, your brother gets smoked, like, right off the bat. Yeah, that's early. They're, they're razzing you for being a pussy and chasing skirts. <laughs> Sense make. <laughs> this gotta be a big male, he's so smart. Yeah. Did you know Bass Pro bought Alcabellas? Yeah. Pretty sad. Yeah. I would have never guessed that could have happened, like, I don't know, 10 years ago. Bellas just, like, outpriced themselves. They lost a lot of business. Yep. Yeah. Well, Bass Pro is still, like, expensive, but not nearly as much as what the Bellas was. They just had that name that was, like, the name for the outdoor industry. And then, like you said, sort of keep doing that more and more. Do you have a track down there? No, I just kind of okay. went this way because the last one pointed in this direction. I got you. I got it here. I always enjoy going to Cabela stores though. I mean they're they're pretty nice. Also um, one over here. There are mounts everywhere and they got yeah. like a food area where you can get like elk meat and stuff. How are they gonna like is it gonna be like Bass Pros Cabela's or something like that? Are they keeping the name? They're keeping the name. Okay. I mean, Cabela's is a big enough name on its own. Yeah, that's the thing. You don't want to lose that. Can't get lifetime warranty stuff. R.I.P. Gander Mountain. <laughs> That place was all right, like 15, 20 years ago, but it started. All the ones I went to anyway were just really what the overall quality of stuff they had wasn't good. Fleeing 30 minutes ago? What? How the hell did that happen? I didn't even pay attention when I picked up that track. That makes sense. You don't even have a Bass Pro in the state? That's surprising. You'd think there'd be... There'd be one in, like, Bozeman or something. I don't think there's a Bass Pro in Ohio anywhere. There might be. I know there's a Cabela's, like, an hour away from here. It's like a small one, though not as much fun as the big ones i've never been to a cabela's there's not i think it's like west virginia or somewhere is the closest mm -hmm. one the one in west virginia is cool as shit i was gonna go with one of my friends a couple of years ago but something happened that i couldn't go it's almost like a museum in a lot of ways just with all the stuff they have mm-hmm they have like an aquarium that's got a whole bunch of like freshwater fish in it. It's pretty cool. Um, they have like a giant display with a whole bunch of mounts like right in the middle of the store. Yeah, I've seen some of that. They have I like uh, they have a thing you walk into, and there's a whole bunch of record book bucks. White tails, muleys. That's pretty neat. That's pretty neat. Yeah. I, there's two of them out there, and they're both really small. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping there's still big males to be discovered.
There was a pheasant right here. I don't know where he went. Just flew. Damn it. Well, there's another. I live close to the one in West Virginia. It's a really nice store. I like stopping by there sometimes. There's a there's a Bass Pro on the way to where uh, we're going elk hunting. We stopped there the last time. We'll probably end up stopping there again. It's a big one, so there's some neat stuff. It's just not as cool as what Cabela's is. Cabela's has those cinnamon nuts. Uh, like almonds? No, I've cinnamon had, nuts. I've had cinnamon toasted almonds before, not at Cabela's, but just in general. Is that a third buck to the right, or did the one on the left move way over? Yes. Thank you. Last day of summer. Big sad. Big sad that's, indeed. <laughs> that's one thing I don't miss. <laughs> yeah. There's a pheasant over there. Big Small male. Oh. He maxes at 20. <laughs> oh god. 15 to 21. That is a manster. Yeah. Don't worry. I'll get him. There he is. There he is. Oh, God. I can't even see it. Yeah. Smoked it. Holy. Can't do anything else. Don't worry. I can smoke a pheasant at 80 meters. <laughs> <laughs> Almost hunting times. It is hunting times for anybody with a antelope tag. Yes, sir. I can't really decide what uh what the best course of action for next year would be, whether to uh go like early when it's hot just do spot and stalk maybe hunt water if that doesn't work right or go like mid late september and just do half archery and then smoke one with a gun if we don't have one yet that seems like the safe strategy anyway yeah although Insert. Ooh, wait Got like 10 minute old tracks on that mule deer. Where the hell? He's going this way. Yeah. Big male. See, I told you he's smart. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Insert stand pods. Yes! I don't think it's antelope season yet here. I know in Wyoming it starts in most areas on the 15th. Anyone else gonna try and smoke a big prong boy this year? I've always wanted to go hunting, but I don't know how to start. Um... Is that just in general? Are you talking about traveling out of state? Or you, you just, you haven't done it even where you live? Got to talk to Dave and, what was her names? Tom and Deke. Yeah, Dave. Dave and Mang Chang. Yes, sir. There's a track over here. Oh, boy. The biggest male. It's just outside our view. I only got a doe prong boy tag. Ooh. 
At least the good thing about that is you're a resident, so you're not spending a ton of money to hunt them. <laughs> like, a lot of people that, that are from, like, out of state will get doe tags only. And that's a lot of money to spend to travel to get, like, 30 pounds of meat. Yeah. All the archery season started on the 7th of September. These are older tracks now. What the hell? Yeah. But this Woody, Woody Dees one. This one's older too. Good. Wouldn't want to actually find them or nothing. You should go IRL water buffalo hunting. I am not leaving this country. <laughs> Unless I go to Canada. I am not leaving this country. They could probably import some water buffalo to Texas. Don't worry about it. At that point, I might as well just shoot a longhorn or something. <laughs> 30 pounds of meat off a decent meal? Yeah, pretty much. They're not the meatiest of boys. I am. Holy... Yeah, I'll, next year I think, uh, I was thinking about getting a mule deer tag, but I might just go with, uh, get a either sex antelope tag and then maybe just get like a, a doe tag for 50 bucks or whatever it is. Easy. I haven't hunted ever. So basically, even just to get started with it, I mean, as long as you've got camo and something to shoot a deer with, there's plenty of public land, just go and, and hang out. I mean, it depends how important to you killing something is. If you just want to go experience it and maybe see some deer or whatever, just go, go hang out on public land. You don't need you don't need all the bells and whistles just to get started. Trotting. What? This one right here? Yeah. Only big males do that. I told you that story. <laughs> yeah. Oops. Oops, I did it again. I'm spreading my cheeks. Oh my god. G Man versus Water Buffalo Stream. I have to spend a lot of money for travel just because I'm moving from South Dakota to Montana right before everything I have tags for. I think that move would be good in the long haul, though. Have a lot more opportunity in Montana. What's this? 18 to 25. Oh boy. We're actually on his trail. We're Come gonna smoke him. Alright, folks. We're tracking this mega giant buck. He's, he's outsmarted us so far. But I've got both of my eyes peeled in both directions. It's the seventh. Do you 
want to see deer on public land, especially here in Michigan, go away from where the people are? And that's just a general rule of thumb anywhere. But, I mean, even then, you can, there's places you can go and still find does and small bucks. There's an area that I hunt sometimes. I mean, I have enough private land I can hunt that I tend to do that, but sometimes I'll go out to this. Good. What the hell? <laughs> Did you ID that? There's a whitetail. Okay. So I'm going to stay on the mule deer then? Yes. Yeah. No, you. 198. I don't buy it. 108. <laughs> huh? What? Big issue lately is rich people buying up land around public lands and blocking access, at least here in Idaho. That's pretty much just the whole the whole western <laughs> part of the country that's going on. In the east, you don't have to worry about it too much because roads aren't really private here like they are out west roads are maintained and they're public roads in most cases so you can get to public land a lot easier out here I'll just wait for him. Okay. Honestly, this is probably just a non-tip. Yeah, that would be stupid. Okay. Who was that? I assume it was him. I don't know. I never ID'd where he was. He should have been, like, in front of us. I don't know how he would have... No, we were here. That was kind of in front of us. Yeah, I couldn't tell where that came from, so hell, it's probably a massive male. Sounded like, it must have been like just at the top of this little hill. Do you want to go get the weight anyhow? Yeah. I'm excited to be tracking an 85 to 100 white tail and a thick muley as well. <laughs> I already know. I do think he's probably pretty big, because... Or pretty heavy, rather. Because knee spook from decently far away, and the worst thing we did was crouch to that spot. Yeah, he still should have been like 60 meters away, not even being able to see us. He must have been closer if it was him. He called from fairly far away. That's why I was confident enough to go that far. Side of this track there. Yeah. yeah. It makes sense from where I heard it. 70 to 85. Hmm. Hello. I see Hi, it. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> Saw it put its head down. Mm hmm. Ow! Meh! <laughs> <laughs> Shoost any giants yet? Hell nah, dude. Yeah, you shot a giant pheasant. Any fires in Wyoming? 
Not at the moment. Yep, he was playing. Quality. I'm pumped to go back to Colorado to hunt. What are you hunting? Elk. Weed. Ooh, max weight pheasant track. That's a that's a big meal. Where? <laughs> no, back here. I don't, I don't want to click off of this, but it's two point four to three, uh, forty six minutes, which means it's probably like just over there. Hmm. Hold on. Let me uh. Let me talk to him real quick. <laughs> 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 That's the goofiest sounding caller. <laughs> it's a crow caller. <laughs> Sounds more like the hog squealer. Yeah, it does. <laughs> that guy is a big male. He's a big goober. Yes, that too. I don't know which way he went. It's showing this way. Are we still tracking a pheasant? No. <laughs> do people actually call pheasants IRL? I have never seen anybody do it. I think you can try to locate them, but... Oh. That's not him. Uh, I'm pretty sure you're better off just trying to flush him up anyhow. Let the dogs yeah. find him if you can do it that way. It's been a long time since I've smoked some pheasants. I'd like to do that. I've never hunted them. They're fun. A lot of fun. They're probably the best looking game bird that you can hunt. Yeah. But it's just, it's cool. Just, especially if you got a dog pointed out and flush that bad boy up. Just give him the smoke. Yeah, my friend had a couple of hunting dogs a while back and that was something he wanted to do, but... I don't even think he ever got to do it with him. Ah, that sucks. Yeah. Pheasants just keep getting more and more rare, too. A lot of habitat loss. Yeah. I think they stock them here. Is that... I guess that's just graphics being weird. They taste good. They taste real good. They, we did, we had them one time, smoked, wrapped in bacon. I think we like chopped up apples and like put the apples in it. Oh. It was so good. They're, they're good just about any way you can have them. Probably not as good as grouse. I'd, I'd say they are. They taste a lot like grouse. You get a little more meat, too. Big, big breasty boys. No, you... Small male. I heard one over here. I can't find it. They're like right by the blind. I heard one off to the right too. Oh, there's the buck. He's a decent male. Oh yeah. 155 to 200. I know he's not going to make that though. 145 to 170. Yeah. I 
think that's in. What's the weight on it? 70 to 85. Yep. Not sage grouse, though. Anything that eats nothing but sage, <laughs> it's just... Yeah. Why he no listen to my calls? Because he's probably still spooked. He doesn't look like it, though. Yeah, he's acting normal. Grouse are really good. I hate to say it, but I might not be getting, might not be getting a small game tag. <gasps> that was my plan. I was going to take a twenty-two and smoke a whole bunch of them, but I, now that I'm going for three weeks, I don't know if I can afford it. I have to go have a good stream. All right, Dawson. Thanks for stopping by. See you next week. We do quail wrapped in bacon. I've never killed a quail before. I think he's coming in. I don't freaking know. It looked like he turned to come in. There's a buck. A giant buck. After we get this, I think fast travel over to the lodge and head northwest. Yeah. Made it. Holy... Just in time for the biggest mail of Call of the Wild. Uh, you get an upland game license with your, your conservation license. I wish Wyoming did it that way. Especially now that they're they're charging a lot more for that stuff. It'd be nice if it was just a combo thing. I'd have to spend like a little over a hundred for my small game slash bird license. And that's if if they didn't raise the archery tag to like seventy five bucks, then I'd go for it. But I gotta I gotta spend like thirty wing wings on the conservation stamp and then another seventy five on the archery tag. I found that big male pheasant, by the way. Where? Uh, to the right of the blind, 24 to 30 max weight. Holy. Tell you what, when you go to smoke the deer, <laughs> I'll just, uh, toss a 17 around his way. Hold on a minute there, Chief. Do you want the pheasant more? <laughs> yes. Okay, then. I haven't killed, like, an actually, like, big pheasant, I think, ever. Is he like on that hill? Yeah. Easy max is at 27. Really? All right. I saw that one earlier and I was I didn't even say anything cuz I didn't think that was the one. You cocksucker. He didn't even look at me. So I did, I thought he was fine and then he just takes off. He was looking on my screen. Just smoked the pheasant. Alright. Bigger male anyway. Close. Oh, I just missed. That one only goes up to 27. Mm hmm. That's a big disappointment. He's 2.6 to 3 kilos. Usually <laughs> you see bad. that, it's a big male. Yeah.
Yeah, that's the one. I see you looking at him. Yeah. Max is 27. Huh. I would have guessed he was 27 minimum. Yep. Boy. Is him running right at me? What are you doing there? Or is he the one in the back? Yes. I can't, I can't see. spot him. Yeah, this is him right here. Smoked him. Got the other one, too. There's one right there. Oh, no! I finally got it, like, on him, and I freaking had to reload. There you Excuse go. Excuse me. Thank you. Jesus. <laughs> I was aimed right at him and just kept missing him. Excuse me. Yeah. Two point nine kilos, dude. Dude, that's dumb. <laughs> <laughs> that's almost always giant when they get the max weight. Yeah. You calling everything reset, Layton, mission reset, lost outpost, discovered marks and lookout towers, park a mission reset, everything unlocked is still there, all need zones got gone except cinnamon teal. What the... I don't understand. Smoke. Just throw the gun at him next time. I guess. I was aimed right on him. That is pretty big disappoint, though. He weighed 2.9. Are you kidding? Just about the uh, par for the course for these streams. Did you forget yep. the second one? No, I got yeah. it. I, I got claim a, the 18. I got a muley grunt right here at the outpost. Are you kidding me? Holy... If it's if it's like a big typical, I'll let you have it. I don't need any more. <laughs> what mule deer? Yeah. For what? I don't need it. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, if it's like a, yeah. I, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. If it's like a the biggest male. I killed two of the biggest males. <laughs> Wait. What's the other one? I got a 244 and a 241. When was the 241? When I was. And hot on that grind on Timbergold. Aaron and Vector, I think, were in. I hosted for them. And Oops. I went to that, you know that spot, like right in the middle of that, that north to south river? Yeah. I was sitting in there. I heard a grunt. I turn around, I look, and I just see the biggest male call of the wild looking at me. <laughs> I'm like, holy shit, that's a 240. I smoked him, and he was. Was that before or after Vector got that 243? After. Okay. One of the best videos is where the guy chases a pheasant and decked it by throwing his bow. It is good. There was an attempt. There darn sure was. Did you get a grunt from that buck? Yes. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not in a spot where I can see. No, it's a good thing there's a wall right here. Yeah. You Naturally can... occurring rock formation. <laughs> Hi. Move! What is that? What are you doing? <laughs> I don't. I somehow managed to like climb on top of you. I was wondering if that could help boost me onto the wall. Are you on no the other? Oh, you are. Only hunting pressure. Yeah, I figured I might as well go this way. 
We ought to be able to hear him walking by now. I thought I might have heard something a second ago, but it also might be you. I still can't see all these flowers. He's down to the left somewhere. Yeah, I can. Oh, there he is. He's small man. There he goes. I've seen him for a second. Yep. Oh, there he goes. Holy big male. <laughs> Professional hunters, and then we go and <laughs> the spook it too. The need zones are supposed to be reset, by the way. Yeah. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Sleepy boy hours now. See, I'm starting to actually get awake to the point that I don't think I'm going to be able to just go take a nap right after this. <laughs> it is, what time do you say? It's like usually 20 after 1, right? Somewhere yeah. in there. Yup. Get big sleepy. I don't know why. I guess that's just long enough, I have enough energy, and then just tapers off, get so freaking tired. Well, it's definitely not for a lack of excitement in this game. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully now my maps have all those rares I was never finding. All the biggest, rarest males. See, I'm conflicted right now, because I've, I've been sitting here thinking some. If the reset worked, and everybody's pop files are reset, if I want to play multiplayer, now's the time, because that's usually, like, any time that I've done population resets, there tends to be a diamond or two running around if I hunt the map long enough and can find it. Yeah. <sighs> But I want to make sure that there's not something big heckin' broke before I get in there. <laughs> get that thick 1400 diamond in yeah. there. Yeah. Well, I don't understand that. Like, I thought the whole point was to clear the... Maybe it's just the leaderboard that's cleared and they stay in the hunting log? I don't... I don't know. Me too. <coughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Oh shit, Twix is bringing back their cookies and cream. Hell yeah. What? Twix is bringing back their cookies and cream. Like candy bar? Yeah. I didn't know they had anything but original. Yeah! Well, left and right. That's the stupidest thing. I can't believe they're still, like, promoting that. They should try to get in on politics with it and see what happens. I see it. Wait. <laughs> no, I don't. I see nothing. Yeah, same, Julia. I thought... I thought it was all going to be gone for the most part. Cookies and cream Twix? Yeah! It's the best... Honestly, it's the best kind of Twix. Oof. They had peanut butter ones that were good, but... Cookies and cream is where it's at. Should I hunt Timber Gold? Send it. I haven't been on that map in a long time, so it could be good. Could not be good. Who knows? 
I was there, like, within the last week, and it was, I mean, you know, two big frame mule deers, not bad. Ooh. We got a group. Oh, Wait, oh no, no, it's a whitetail. Oh, <laughs> big males, hybrids. <laughs> hybrids. <laughs> 203 scoring hybrid whitetail. Holy! Mule tail. Damn, you get all the good flavored stuff over there? I don't want to hear it. Because from what I've heard, England has got, has got all the good cane. Yes. That's just what I've heard. I need to get I need to get some more M and M's bars too, dude. I I don't know how long you've been talking about them, and it's been advertised at the local store <laughs> here, and they still don't have them. I've been talking about them since like January. Yeah, I was gonna say it's been close to a year by now. <laughs> oh, he's grunting a lot. He's a big male. I thought that about my non-tip that started my channel. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to go get me a big big bear 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 my <laughs> Sound like the guy that got struck by lightning in the great outdoors. Benjamin Franklin? <laughs> yeah, that was him. The deer are not as picky this breeding season. They've been recorded breeding with elk, moose, muleys, pheasants, stumps, rocks, anything that will stay still long enough. I feel it. Have you been staying still? Yes. Okay. Oh, monster male. I wonder where the mule deer got to. <laughs> I don't know. This guy must have ran them off. Just because they, they saw this tank and just booked it. policeman and the horse. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Chill out. It kind of hurt. It sounded painful. Well, there's a mule deer doe. We're into it now. The breeding has already begun. I'm ready to spook everything in the woods with this shot. Okay. Smoked him. Where the hell is Muley? Dead. Good. Deer child hybrid. Big male. Yeah. Yeah. We have some newly white tail hybrids here. Oh, I know. That'd be pretty hot. What was that one guy trying to tell us on that stream, all of the above? Something to do with mule deer, whitetail, hybrids, or something? What? What? That makes uh, sense. Of course he would be down hello? there. Oh, well, he's a big male. Wait. Is that the one that we spooked before? Yes. So that's not the one we heard call a little bit ago. Nope. Okay. It was a new trail. I'm gonna give this muley what for. Smoked him. Mm-hmm.
Is the true patch out for PS4? Does anybody know? I don't know. He said mule deer are a cross between whitetail and blacktail. Isn't it oh, the yeah. other way around? He was trying to make some kind of strange argument that that was the case and way back in the, I don't know, prehistoric times or something. I, it was weird. Because he was there, right, when it was going on? Yeah, he was there documenting the process. Actually, a decent weight on this one. Yeah, up to 125. At 130. Only a big, big male would just turn a walk away from a call like that. Mm-hmm. Massive muley male. There they are. I see deer anyway. All those with There's a, a thick good... white tail. Oh my yeah. god, that looks like a big male. 170 to 210. Oh my fuck. Don't get too excited now. I gotta mm. calm myself down. Collect, collect. That's One... a big male. 175 to 200. Ah! <laughs> you sound like Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Holy. I wasn't even uh... looking at it. <laughs> I, it had to be done. It had to be done. Jesus, God, don't cuck me again. <laughs> I will not be cucked. Please. Don't cuck me. Uh, I've been cucked too many times by this game. Ah, uh, fuck. Please. I just, I'm not asking for much. I just want a 190. That's all. He can be 190.000. I will be happy. Please, God. I'm scared, dude. <laughs> I'm scared. Please. Well, it's usually approximately four above the estimate, so we'll see. <laughs> uh, um, I'll take a look at him. Make sure he's got eight on each side. I think he does. He does. That's he's... a lot of points. When they have that tiny claw at the end, it's always an 8x8. Well, you can get 7x8, actually. That would be funny. That's an 8x8. That's oh, an 8x8. Please. Please. Fuck! Okay, so I typed in the chat as we're running over here 184. <laughs> it's pretty close. God! I mean, at least it's the biggest one I've killed in like a year, so... When I seen him, I didn't. I think he's got short tines, mainly. Because he's got yeah. the frame. Damn it! <laughs> That's odd. No, you. <laughs> the way you're holding your gun. <laughs> Do I look hot? Damn it. Ah, oh, jeez. Are you kidding me? We're getting closer. Only like six more cuckenings, and then you might get one. <sighs> this game sucks. <laughs> At least, like you said, <laughs> at least we're getting closer anyway. I just didn't even believe when I saw that one he didn't look it. Yeah. I didn't want to kill the hype in case it was one, but... 183 is pretty decent. Like, I, the best one I've killed since Trophy Lodges two years ago was 185. Yep. Yeah. That's the best one I've killed in a long, long time. Yeah, if you would have typed 192, it would have made it. I don't buy it. It's 
See, that's where Call of the Wild True Axe needs to get, though. Because I looked at that deer at, like, 200 meters, and I was within point nine, basically, of the score just by looking at it. Yep. Damn it. <laughs> Seems like it happens every week now. Like, what the hell? I don't think... Do we have any last week? Was that was last, last week? Was last week the 179? It might have it been. It was either last week or the week before. Because then there was the elk. There's a decent mule running off, I think. Where? Yeah, that's a pretty good one. Where the hell? You just ran oh, off. Oh, I just seen it. I, yeah, I marked it. This spot over here... This is where I had my 199 whitetail, but... There's been a bunch of big mule deer and stuff in here, too. My 230-something mule deer was... Mule deer? <laughs> mule deer was here, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one we were actually tracking. Oh, is it? Yeah. Sense make. Oh, I got a max weight hog. Those are exciting. <laughs> Have to go, boys. See you, Karina. Thanks for dropping by. The hell is that? Oh, a rabbit. I forgot those existed. How mad would you be if I got a 200 whitetail today? Honestly, like, I'm so defeated by this game. <laughs> the The final straw was all the above, killing a 400 Roosevelt the other day. Like, <laughs> I, I just accept that I'm probably not going to get what I want. As works, have good stream. All right, I'll see you later. See you next week. You can watch me not kill a big male then. <laughs> Is a two hundred four muley good? It's good. Anything over 200 is decent. Anything above like 220, I would consider a really big male. Yeah. Alright, where'd he go? over there our last two games on loggers though have told me that this seems to be the hot map right now yeah fair point I had two decent muleys you had a 175 whitetail thick bobcat and then today thick whitetail Soft, thick muley. Yeah, I might have to give this map a bit of a grindy boy. Do you play Call of the Wild? Uh, I have. <laughs> I have no interest in playing it now, though. Maybe, maybe eventually I'll get back to it. They need to release pronghorn. It can be extremely buggy and I'll still hunt them every day. <laughs> yeah. I, I probably won't play it again until they add some kind of new species that I actually really want or there's a new map or something. If they were to do doll sheep to Yukon, would that be something you'd actually play for? Yeah, I think so. That's. I still hope they're going to do that, but I kind of thought it would have happened by now if it was going to happen. Yeah. Got a track over here. Excellent. Wonder why they picked Hirschfeld in the remake on Call of the Wild and not this map. Hirsch is fairly popular 
on Classic, or at least it was. I think up until Valdable, it was probably way more popular just for Red Deer. Yeah. And then you had geese. A lot of people still hunt geese. Because, you know, they're actually fun to hunt in this game. <laughs> They need Mouflon on Hirsch. Would they really fit, though? Not well, I don't think. But, to be honest, I wouldn't complain if they did it. I think Hirsch is too flat for that, realistically. Yeah. Release Flantro Goat. No, he has me kidnapped for 20 more minutes. <laughs> Smoked him. That'll probably be how long it takes just to find this muley. <laughs> probably. We need to hunt geese again. Okay. I wouldn't mind killing a big male. I did get a pretty decent male the last time. 8.3, 8 I think it was, something like that. Yeah, that ain't bad. I think it was the first one I shot, too. Sense me. Why did they pick a German map for the geese and not an American map? They're called Canada geese, not German goose. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't quite make sense, but that's why I thought back in the day when they first put them on Hirschfeld and then Classic. I was like, what? Why not Red Feather? <laughs> I don't think there's anywhere they could really land on Red Feather. I really think that's the biggest thing, the mechanics. They were like, oh, there's fields here, let's just use Hirsch. Yeah. We shot loads of geese that day. Yeah, between the two of us, we had like 60 or 70. Ooh. And then Aaron came in and there was nothing left. You don't hit anything anyway when you shoot flying creatures. Yeah. I had like 35. I think she had like 25. Aaron had two. <laughs> He's roaming. Don't worry. We'll spook him again soon. Remedy that real quick. We get a ton of them in Europe, in the UK, so I assume the rest of Europe's the same. Yes. Uh, okay. That's what I think about that. Would you like Sandhill Crane for hers? Uh, I don't necessarily need them. Some just spooked to the right over here. I bet I know what it was. <laughs> I have a a sneaky suspicion. That was it. Especially considering the placement of this track right here. In the direction it was going. Yeah. It figures we're on a map where you can see for hundreds of meters, but he happens to loop around in the one place that we can't see. It's because he's a big male. See the Rams Cowboys game? Dallas won, so bang. I don't care if they beat the Rams. I don't like the Rams. I hope. I'm glad they beat the Rams, but it's preseason anyway. Rams have scored a total of like 10 points this whole preseason. <laughs> we 
got a few pheasants. I smoked one with a 300. That was good. Is Zeke Elliott still running away from Jerry Jones, or is that stopped? Uh, I think he still is. Last I saw, he was big not pleased. So I guess we're going to argue about football. Are you going to tell me the preseason matters? <laughs> like, I don't... What do you want me to say? You have to establish a winning culture in preseason because Dak doesn't have the experience to win without it. Smoke to him. <laughs> Got to build that confidence. Yeah. Seriously, though, he's going to pass for like 8,000 yards because Zeke's not there and he's just going to make up for it. Yeah. I saw somebody on Twitter said that uh, Amari Cooper is more important than Zeke anyway, and if <laughs> Zeke is the focus of the offense and something has gone horribly wrong, like, what? No, that's actually not it. Like, yeah, because Emmett Smith was the least valuable member of the offense when he played. Makes sense. <laughs> I sure would hate to find this. Yes. I'll go on this side. I came here for hunting, not football. Well, you're not getting either. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to walk around and not find anything. How's that? I got right. Fleeing. Who could have foreseen that? Uh, don't tell me. Dave. You're right. Yeah, I am. Yeah, a joke. I just saw that yesterday. Yes. He's a mad dog. He would have killed me, too, if you hadn't shown up. He wears curlers to bed. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part of the whole thing is the cops. Die, zombie. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. <laughs> Yes. All right, now where'd he go? Right here. Good. I'm not sure how big this thing actually is, by the way. I just saw you had the big rack. Twelve. Sounds fair to me. What is my steam overlay doing? Overlaying. Yeah. Somebody's launching Dota Underlords and it's just giving me notification after notification that he's now playing it. Maybe they have to restart it 37 times to get it to work like I have to do with this well, game. He's really efficient at it because it's like just three right after one after the next. All right. We should... I think I see him. Is that him? Yes. He's decent. 190 to 240. I don't buy it. <laughs> well, I really don't buy it when your ass is in my face. I'm trying to spot it. 190 to 215 for me. Why is my spotting so bad? I don't know. You have, like, the biggest males of this species. You'd think you'd be able to recognize them. Yep. I think he's like a 203. Yeah! Well. It's a good thing I have all these tree sands here, but only one that's actually useful in this spot. I don't know where... Oh, there he is. Did you get him? Mm. He's running like he's hit. Yeah, he's running. Yeah, he's running. 
Zaggy is a nasty old pappy. Well, I could have told you that. Uh. One big nasty pappy boy. I call it the nasty patty. Oops, I dropped it in the toilet. Push it out, we'll dry it with me old gym socks. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard of the raging kid named William? What? Squilliam Fancy Son? That's right! Body! Good shot. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm living your dream, Squiddy. Is I'm gonna, this I'm worth- gonna, oh. <laughs> is this worth actually tracking? Is the question. You shot him with a 30 odd six. He won't be far. It's body blood, but it's good body blood. Yeah, he's down to 20 to 36. I got 12 to 28 or something on that. That's pretty inconsistent. Yeah. Yeah. I hate this game sometimes. Me too. Like when it makes me think I'm getting a big mail and then I don't. What was the last big mail that you got? The non On stream, it was actually a big mail? Just in general. Probably that non tip. I think my last big mail was the non tip too, which was the week after. Well, Bobcat, yeah. but meh. True. Before that, it was uh, doll sheep. Oh, yeah. That was actually on stream as well. I forgot about that one. Yep. It was like a 202. Was it 202, 204? Something like that. Is two o two, I think. Maybe I had the two o four. Nah, I don't remember. I think that's still like the best thing in my lodge is my two o eight. Oh, buddy, yeah. put down the collar. Let's get him. <laughs> it always goes really well on these streams. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Raid grind done. Cheers for the banner to listen in on. Were you, uh, you playing Warcraft or something else? I think she was just spraying ants with Raid. Oh. But I need to check Mad Mobile, see if they actually added anything. Oh yeah, I wanted to get on and see if they did solo battles for normal last night, and I forgot. Do you see a track anywhere? Right in front of me. Remember that thing I said where I didn't think he was going to go very far? Mm-hmm. Oh god. Oh, that's the pheasant. I thought that bobcat was just yeeting out here. Smoked. Mm-hmm. Oh, we got beef in the chat. Holy. Tempers flaring, boys. <laughs> Smoke. Yep, wow. I thought about... There was a... Oh, there's my buck over here. There he is. First? What do I pick up first? I don't know. Your wing wang. 
Well, I already picked that up. Oh. Let me get a look at this. I say, actually... It looks like he's got the different frame. 209. 208. <laughs> Changed my mind. 202. 191. Uh, it's gonna Even go better. bury my face in this rock, then. How is that a 191? I had 190 to 215. This game sucks. <laughs> I had 190 to 240. <laughs> I bet I knew better. I would have been like, holy, that's the biggest male. <laughs> one inch over the minimum. Classics being released soon. Yeah. I that I was thinking about playing that. I never I never got into playing WoW back in the day. I always wanted to, never did. I ended up playing uh, RuneScape instead. G-Man's wing wang is glued to his hand, isn't it? It must be by now. Practically, I mean, it, I, my hand is already, like, molded to the shape of it. <laughs> it it's, I have, like, specific calluses on my hand from overuse. <laughs> overuse. Yeah. We are all bad. He had that, like, that sort of square frame, and I didn't think any tines were short. Yeah. He wasn't very wide, so I was skeptical of him being all too big, because usually the bigger ones kind of curve out a little more. Yeah, I don't think he had the long main beams either. That probably should have been a, a sign. Yeah. Another male bobcat. Holy! I'm clueless with Hunter Classic. Ooh, that, that first um, one might have actually been a big male. I just saw it spook. I'm clueless with the other game, so it's alright. <laughs> yes. What are these spook? We at least go get a track. There was that bobcat. I don't think we're it's probably not worth oh, bothering, yeah. but he looked fat. Wow's a daunting one, huge time vortex. I can believe it. It was the same deal with RuneScape. I never, I had a friend that played that. He put, I don't know how many thousands of hours into it. And then when Old School came out, he put another <laughs> couple thousand hours into that. And I've, between the two of them, I probably got like 500 hours. Uh, yeah, I, I probably shouldn't start uh start tracking anything now because I do need to <laughs> wrap up soon. I got a lot of stuff I got to get done. Yeah, like how you guys are talking about Wow while Sam is watching an episode of South Park about Wow. 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 <laughs> Have they have they said how much it's gonna cost to play WoW Classic? What did you eat? Hmm, some roast beef, some chicken, a pizza. The other day, when I was at the store, I bought chicken, pizza, and I think I got, like, ham lunch meat. And I totally regretted not getting roast beef, so I could have sent you a picture oh. of it. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Coulda, woulda, shoulda. Yeah. 24-hour stream? Nah, dude, I got, I got too much stuff. I gotta get done. My mom will choke me to death when she gets home. 
There's a coyote. Yeah, female. Okay. Wanted to see what if this doe was a rare. Yes. And it's not. Who could have predicted such things? <clears throat> I think you got it. You think so? Pretty sure. <laughs> In reality, though, everything I ate was worse than roast beef chicken in a pizza. <laughs> Taco Bell, mac and cheese, boneless wings, and, like, nearly a full tub of Cool Whip. So that's good. I can't imagine what that would do to me. <laughs> Just a subscription to play nothing up front. So is it what like ten bucks a month or something? Play free till level twenty. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go ahead and end it. That way I can get my stuff done. Okay. Everybody, stop by, watch the stream, watch me uh, get cucked for the third time now. <laughs> uh, it was a good good time. I like I like getting cucked so badly. <laughs> uh, thanks, Julia, for the super chat. And thanks, Flancho, for the the big streamy boy. Providing the cuckening noise. And uh, uh, Palomino wants to know what Cool Whip is. It's just whipped cream, and it's in a it's in a tub. Like I don't know how big the tub is, but it's decent size. I've just been eating that. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, we'll see you next week, probably with some more classic. Bye! Bye!